What is up you guys, it's your boy KC Card coming at you with another set down vlog and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as you can see the title of this video, I will be showing you what I bring to school every day, the kinds of bags I use, and what's inside my bag. And so before we start this video, please make sure to click that subscribe button and click the notification bell beside it to get notified every time I post a new video. So without further ado, let's get to this video. So first of all, disclaimer, I am not the type of person who brings a light bag. My friends really know that I am the one with a heavy bag. I bring a lot to school every day, even though I commute every day from Manila to Laguna. I don't know. I always bring a lot of things. But what I bring to school actually depends on my subject and the kind of bag I use also depends on what day am I going to have, if that makes sense. Basically, I am not the person who always brings the same bag every day. So I think almost every day I change my bag and what's inside my bag. So what I'm going to show you is the usual stuff. We'll start with the bags. So when I have a PE class, I usually bring the biggest backpack I have. I used to bring gym bags when I have PE, but I find it very uncomfortable, especially if I have a lot of things inside. If it gets heavy, I don't know, it's not just, it's not really that comfortable bringing a gym bag to school. So for days with my PE class, I usually bring this bag, this backpack from Parkland. This is a photo show to you. There are two pockets in front. So for the small things, I put it here. And sometimes when I bring my towel and my extra clothes, I put it here in front. There's another zipper here for my usual school stuff. Every after PE, as much as possible, I try to take a shower. I don't want to go to class dripping in sweat. I don't know, it just doesn't feel right. So sometimes I also bring a collapsible towel with me. I'll show you. So ayan. This collapsible towel from Decathlon. This is, I think this is the large one. I think this is the biggest one. But I think they have various sizes that gets even smaller than this. So this gets really compact. It doesn't really take much space in my bag. So this is a nice thing to bring. So for some days, where I feel like I don't need to bring much stuff and I want to bring stylist, is that the term? Fashionable, if that makes sense. I have this backpack from Coach. Uh, as much as possible, if I'm going to bring this, I just pack light. So for days that I don't have to bring much school stuff, this is what I use. Yeah, since it's black, it almost matches anything that I wear. The bag I wear also matches my outfit. Ganun ako kaarte. Another fashionable bag I bring to school. I use this bag if I have a formal event and if I need to dress formal. So I need some shoulder bag, if that's what they call this. This is another bag from Coach. And so when I'm sometimes wearing a suit or a button down to school, this is what I wear. Because, I don't know, wearing backpack with formal clothes doesn't feel right. Is it just me? So this is what's inside the bag. Nothing. Okay, so the second to the most used bag is the most comfortable, easy access bag I have. Especially when you're going to school, like in my school, in DLSU, you need to open your bag every time you pass the gates for the security to check your bag. So as much as possible, if I don't bring much stuff again, I use this tote bag from Straightforward. I know some people see this as a female's bag, but this is actually a guy's bag. It actually depends. Just don't wear it, don't wear it like this. Well, not against the people who wear it like that. I mean, it's up to you. I, I don't care. I don't judge. I usually bring it like this or I hold it. So every time I pass through the security, I just boop, open oh my God. and I'm done. Every time you need easy access to anything and almost everything inside your bag, 
this is easy. So the next bag, my most used school bag is this very old, uh, I told you guys it's heavy, uh, Herschel. It's, this is very old, like look, this is broken. Huh? I had this since grade 10, I think. I had this since grade 10. And I'm in second year college. This is real stuff. I'm now going to show to you what's inside this very heavy bag. So first of all, well, this is not really inside my bag. This is always in my pocket. I hold it all the time. My phone, you can never go out without your phone these days. For this front pocket, charger for my phone, a mouse. I'll show you why later. I have a laptop, kase, which I bring to school almost every day. And I'll show you later. And I'm the type of person who never uses the trackpad. I'm not really comfortable using a trackpad, so I always bring a U USB or Bluetooth mouse with me. Is it just me? And finally, my ID in school. Ayan. I usually have two cases, but the other one got broken. So every time I use the train, you know, easy access, tap, tap. Moving on, I think that's what's inside the small pocket to the inside of this bag. Quarantine got me like. First of all, my laptop. I'll show you my laptop. It's from HP. Why do I always bring my laptop? Because I, I am I'm really comfortable typing my notes, especially for classes like law. You know, you gotta be real fast. I tried a week of note taking in law using pen and paper, and I got so lost so quick. I use Google Drive for my storage since you, always, you can access all your files from all your devices. This case is from... Where is this from? I think Urbanize. I bought this from Urbanize. And it's really nice. This, that's one thing I realized late that I always need to put my laptop in a case. So for the next thing inside my bag, the small stuff, my wallet. Yeah, I know I have a big... Whoop. I know I have a big wallet. I really like big wallets. So my pencil case, a USB. Guys, you should always have USB with you. You never know if you need to transfer a file. A pen with a stylus. I don't know why I have this much pen here. But I have colorful pens. And I use this pens for annotating. You know, it just makes your notes look good. Correction tape. These are my highlighters. Two from Muji, one green, one blue, and one from Stabilo. I really like this color. It's so neutral. I don't really like using highlighters that are too bright. It just hurts my eye. A Sharpie, another pencil pen, and friction pen. I always use friction pen. A normal pen, another normal pen, another normal pen from Muji. Another friction na three colors. And finally, a mechanical pencil from Muji. And this is also from Muji. Next! Now I know this is quite unusual. This is my sanitary kit. Don't call it KKI kit. Whatever you call it. Now I'm the type of person who always take a shit in school. So this is a lifesaver. I swear. But I don't usually bring this big. Huh? Nakataon lang na I run out of the small one. So come on guys. It's 2020. It's normal to take in school. I always do. Alcohol, chapstick from Vaseline because my lips are always dry. A small a small pocket fragrance from Axe. Sponsor lang to ng Elsal. My... What are you doing guys? What's this contact lens? Another perfume. Next! Last but not the least. I don't know. What do you call this? Folder? I always try to put all the papers and my notebooks and even some stuff here. So every time I need it, pull it out and look for it here. Instead of like going through all your things inside your bag. That's so hassle. And also protects your uh, no, your papers. If in case it rains, your bag gets wet, you know, your papers are safe. So what's inside this? First of all, my notebook. So this notebook is from National Bookstore. I used to buy Moleskine and Muji notebooks, but it's not really worth it. This is a dotted notebook. I don't know if, it, you, can, if you can see that. It's a dotted notebook. All of my subjects are consolidated here. For the first page, my things to do, my reminder. Oh my god, I'm the camera. Ko. So I use dividers. I put my subject, my some of my professor notes. So, yeah, 
something I do. I put professor notes there, like how your professor grades, you know, their comments sa uh, the LSU Community Forum, the props to pick. I put also some, I don't know if you can see it, sticky tapes for the dividers. And yeah, that's some of my notes. Let's save that for another video. So, some papers, some readings, something for accounting, my columnar notebook for accounting, a scientific calculator, a ruler, and finally, yellow pad and worksheets for accounting. You know, I don't usually bring the big one. I don't get people who brings the whole piece. Like, I, I have this. I don't get the people who brings it like this. Like, why the hell do you So ayon, my camera battery died. And charge it for a few minutes. I hope. Please battery naman, makisama ka naman. I hope ni siya maglo, but until the end of this video, please la. So back to this. If you're carrying this around, I don't judge. It's just weird. Yellow paper. Just bring a few. You don't need to bring the whole bunch or the whole pad. So. Yeah, basically that is it. That is what I'm bringing to school every day. That's my bags. That's what's inside my bag. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Share this video to your friends. Put your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget to subscribe. And remember, this is Casey Gardner, where your world meets mine. Coming out. Bye! By the way, if you are wondering why I am wearing this cap, you know, quarantine, bad hair day every day, I badly need a haircut. The heck? Look at my hair. Found me. And this is the epitome of me filming. Yay. Time to clean. So fun.